Everyone, what is up? Today's day 12 of the Zero to Start in 30 Day Challenge, and today we're going to go over the differences between MailChimp and Clavio. And I think that's how you say it. So, the last couple of days we were working a lot with styling and making our website look a lot nicer, and especially yesterday, once we got into stock photography and started using our main image background, it looks a lot more professional now. But when a user comes to the website, we want to be able to grab their email so that when our product is released, we can contact them and then keep in contact with with them to try and upsell a product or just reach out for feedback. And so the way that we do that is through email capture and we're going to use a couple services. Um, we could either have the selection between MailChimp, Clavio, ConvertKit, uh, and there's a bunch more, uh, Aweber, Constant Contact. But the two that I really like to use a lot are MailChimp and Clavio for two different reasons. MailChimp is one that probably everyone's heard of, uh, it's been around for a while. And the reason I like it is because it has a huge free tier. I believe you could get up to 2,000 subscribers and send up to 12,000 emails a month for free, which is none of the other services do that. So that's the big advantage there. It does make it a lot easier to create a form and integrate it into your site, which we're gonna go over in today's lesson. But if you want something more for e-commerce related, uh, Clavio is the way to go. The only downside there is that the free tier is limited at 250 contacts, 500 emails a month. So when you're starting up, you're trying to save as much money as you can to spend towards other areas. And so I'm going to go with MailChimp on this section so that once we start getting users to the website, we don't wanna to have to change to a whole different service just because there's a limit on the free tier. Once we hit a certain amount of subscribers, if we hit 2,000 subscribers, that means we're doing really well and we can afford to pay for a service. So then we can decide whether we want to pay for MailChimp or we're gonna pay for Clavio. And if you're watching this on YouTube, go to usefullyuseful.ly to check out the step-by-step -step tutorial along with the code associated with adding an email capture to our beautiful looking website. See ya.